Today I'm planting a bare root rose. When you receive your rose, soak your roots in a bucket of water. If you can't plant them immediately, change the water daily. Before you plant, the roots should be in the water for at least eight hours to get well hydrated. Inspect the canes. If you see any broken roots or broken dead shoots, just trim them off. Choose a sunny location to plant your rose. Six hours of sun is good a day. When you're digging your hole, it should be deeper and wider than the roots. The roots should not bend or break when you're inserting them in the hole. To determine proper planting depth, inspect the trunk. If there's a large noticeable bump on the trunk, this is the bud union. This area should be planted at or below the soil surface. If there's no bud union, find the crown. The crown is the area where the shoots meet the roots. This is the area that should be planted at or just slightly below the soil surface. If you're living in colder areas of the country, plant both the crown and the bud union two to three inches below the soil. This will help insulate the plant. Insert the plant into the hole at the correct depth and gently return the soil. Break up any clods and gently pack it down as you go. You can pack with your hands and then also your feet. Build a dam around your rose plant. This dam will hold a reservoir of water and it will make watering much easier in the future. Give your plant a good soaking drink. Use about two gallons of water so that the water percolates down to the bottom of the roots. One more step is to mound soil or mulch around the crown. This will help the cane stay hydrated and not dry out. This is only temporary. Once the shoots start to sprout, you can gently remove this. In just a few weeks, you'll have some shoots and you're on your way to beautiful roses this summer.